I've been out of the game for for about a month now, I think, to the to the day. It's been a month. Um, but obviously I'm delighted I'm just around the corner from my home as well. So it, that's that's important to be close to my family, obviously. So um I'm excited to 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 be back playing football now. So um I've got I think it's a ten games um, right with the cup. So um, it'll be it'll be good to get back playing, hopefully scoring goals and hopefully get the team pushed up the league. Yeah, has it been a frustrating few weeks for you when you've not had the club and not known knowing what's going on? Yeah, it has, yeah. Um I think my wife's probably will agree with me. Being around the house twenty four seven is a bit a bit too much to be honest. But yeah, it's it, it was tough up whenever I, I go to go out and do a run myself. The, the snow's obviously put an effect to that. So it's been hard, but I've been trying to stay fit as much as I can and um I think probably a couple of maybe a, a week. I'll be at the scratch and we be fully fit. How much are you relishing the challenge that, that lies ahead with Kamarik? Obviously, their form hasn't been as great this season. Um, obviously, training with the, the team today for the first time and seeing the players and the puzzles and how, how they're, they're down in the bottom three. Um, I think with the squad of players that we have, I think they, they could be definitely in the top six, but obviously, Whatever reason that is, um, hopefully I can come in and add to the team and get the goals that will push us up the league. And um, if we can get into the top six, um, we'll be happy. So um, that's, I think that's the aim to try and get up closer to the, the top six. Kyle, how much do you feel that this... Sorry. Go on, Stephanie. Kyle, how much do you feel that this move to Kilmarnock will settle you in you're at that point in your career you know you've got a lot of experience been to a lot of other clubs as well but is is this is this a point where you feel you need to settle a bit um yeah i've been on the on the move uh i think over the last maybe two years since i left rangers i've probably been four months six months there here and everywhere um but hopefully i, I can come in get the goals and do well for the team and if they want to offer me something at the end of the season, then obviously we'll, I'm happy to talk. Um, I'm, as I said, I'm only I'm only around the corner as well, so it'll be it'll be good if if, if I'm still here at the end of the season and uh, next season. But um, it is I'm I'm hopefully I put in the performances that will get me maybe a longer contract or someone else will give me a a deal maybe a year or two. So yeah, I think it is time now to find find a base that I'll I'll be happy playing for and just concentrating on football rather than moving away and missing family and things like that. How much are you looking forward to working under the new manager? Obviously, he's just come in this week as well. Yeah, I've, I've, obviously I've known the gaffer from um, being involved in the Northern Ireland as well. Um, and I've always got, a, got along well with him. And whenever he, he, he gave me a call the other night, I think of the Brennery ticked all the boxes where he wants to take the team and um if I'm if I'm fit um he says I'll I'll, I'll probably play as well. So that's that's probably the important thing for me is getting getting proper fo uh, football now. So um I'm excited to for the challenge. Kyle, okay. how important is your you know your experience and knowledge of the league you know how advantageous is that going to be to Kilmarnock in the situation that they find themselves in just now? Yeah obviously I, I, I know the league um, I've, I've had numerous years here um, in the league and uh, obviously the last time I was at Rangers it didn't really work out and um, I think it didn't really fit into the manager's plans but um, they've kicked on obviously Rangers have so I'm here I want to Give my give everything I know about the league, pass it on to the players, and hopefully, um, my performances will will give the other players a lift as well, and they can up their game, and um, we can look back at the the six losses that we've had in a row, um, and um, put them to the back of our minds and start picking up wins. How hopeful you are, are you that you can be part of that tomorrow against your old side? Yeah, it'd be nice. Um, of Obviously, I haven't trained with the team for for a month now, but being back today for the first time, um, it, it felt good getting in touch of a ball. And the manager decides to put me in the squad. I'll be happy, and if I get on, I'll be it'll be uh, another bonus for me. Um, and 
obviously if we get, get a goal and get some points up Rangers, it'll be, it'll be good. Kyle, what's different about Rangers this season? Um, I think everyone just wants the same thing. Um, uh, they have a, a manager there that has obviously brought his experience of playing at the highest level, um, playing for Liverpool for was it 15, 16 years. They had to win every game. He was a he wanted to win every game. So I think he's put that across the whole squad now. And um, with experience in the squad and the youth in the squad, it's it's a great mix. And they've got some amazing players there that will well obviously I hope they'll they'll play for Rangers for many years to come and um they or they could go on um the different different things but it's just the way they're playing. They don't look like they're gonna get beat. Um, no way. If if they if they need something, there's always one player that's gonna pull them out of it and um, get the results that they need. So obviously they've been superb this season and they're deserving so to be in the top of the league by numerous points. Um, and I think everyone realizes that they they will go on to. To win the league this season, I think if 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 you don't think they will, then I think there's something wrong with you. Um, but it's it, they've had a good season and uh, they probably deserve to be champions at the end of the season. But obviously, I'm Kil Kilmarnock player now, and I'll be going out and trying to put a dent in there on the on the road to the the title. Has it surprised you just how they have clicked though? I mean, they're, they're very solid at the back now, and I'm sure Alan McGregor has played a huge part in that as well. Um, the, you know, the defence is, is very strong. Um, you've got, hopefully for yourself, you're going to be up against that tomorrow. How, how do you break that down? Um, obviously, we, it's, it depends how, how we go and play. If we believe that we can get something from the game, then I'm sure there'll be chances in the game that will get and it's obviously it'll be up to myself and the other strikers and the attacking players to take them. But I'm not shocked how well they've done. And um, when I was there you could see that they're they're a team that was gonna go on to great things and this season is, is just showed it that they're they've been exceptional and they they'll they'll be champions at the end of the season. So it hasn't surprised me. Um and I know that anyone that's been close to the squad and Know the squad, it probably hasn't surprised them. Um, but it's a, uh, I think it's probably made it even more exciting how Celtic has crumbled, um, how they've actually just crumbled. To be honest, and um, it's I think it's a, an added bonus for for Rangers and their fans that they're so far in front, and they're now shows why they're the 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 best team in Scotland. And how how close were you to to going to Romania? Um, um, I did get a I did get a phone call about going, um, but I don't really think there was any legs in it at all. Um, they they gave me an offer, um, but to to go out there, obviously I'd be going out there without my family because they'd have to isolate. And then if if I'm selected for the international in March and April, they'd have to isolate in Scotland to come back and. Stuff like that. There, it was it. It was a no goer to be honest. Um, I wanted to stay close to home, and um, obviously, thankfully, Kamara came in and the gaffers came in and gave me an opportunity to play football close to home and um, in a good standard. So um, it was a no brainer to take it up. Thanks, Kyle. Good luck tomorrow. Cheers. Thank you. Hey, the team struggled badly in front of in front of goal this season. How much are you sort of relishing that responsibility of being the talisman of being the player that, that was. Uh, like players can go to for goals. Yeah, I believe I believe I'll I'll get goals if if I uh, if I get chances I'll I'll score goals for the team. Um, and watching them against Motherwell, they had I think was it between thirty five and forty crossed into the box. Um, and to not get a goal or a decent chance from them it, it is obviously disappointing. But hopefully, if if the if the wide men the midfielders keeps on providing them type of chances for the for the strikers and myself on. I'm pretty sure I'll I'll uh, get my fair share of goals in the in the last ten ten games. 
Do you have any other offers from any other teams in Scotland or England? Or? Um, just, there was talk, but obviously there was, anyone can talk, have a conversation with you about joining them, but um, Kilmarnock, they, from the first first phone call the gaffer gave me, I knew there were there was legs in it, and then it was it was just perfect for me. Everything everything ticked all the boxes. Yeah, he says if I was fit, I'll play, and um, I'm confident I'll score goals in this team as well. So um, it'll it'll do me the world of good to get back playing again, playing for a team that will create that amount of chances in games, and um, obviously where we are at the minute will be a it's an added incentive to to go in, do well for the team and get us pushed up the table. So um, that's what I'm probably most excited about.